that's what I want to introduce you as. What are you going to call him? Oh, Sweet Cheeks. <laughs> Sweet Cheeks Dave Hewitt. Man, they're landing on thick this morning, guys. We got all three of us folks in the water. They're noodling around in the street light, getting a vibe. Wait for that sun to come up. This is Teresa's. I better be careful, huh? So I picked this spot because we were showing 15 to 20 people. We get out here, it's blowing six miles an hour, and we're in a completely protected area, so we got glass, and I'm walking the dog on glass. You've got to be kidding me. We already caught three fish, and he left the boat ramp yet. Come on. Ooh, that's a nice trout. That's getting close. You know, one of my first trout. Come on. Is this a little further out? Yeah, yeah. I haven't even caught the grass on here. You don't need to. You can do it. Yep. I caught the little red. That gra that, this, the grass flat runs out 100 yards. Oh, okay. Well, see, they're still hanging up in all this. Mm -hmm. Ooh, got a hitch. There you go. Oh, yeah. Good job. That's the third rib. Right up in the grass, huh? Off, just off the grass, yeah. Come on, he might be a keeper. That looks like a slot fish, sir. Well, it could be. It could be. And I'm in the way. There we go. We got him. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to back this up. You got him on fish bite. Shrimp. Look at that, huh? Beautiful fish. Holy smokes. Good job. Yeah. Right about on. 10 feet off the grass. Okay. Yep. 22? You probably could put him on 22. Mm -hmm. yeah. Where you been finding them at, David? Been finding them out here in the grass and the flats. Um, apparently their reds are up in the grass, mm -hmm. the tall grass. They're kind of scattered out. Been some hard hits, but um, I think the bite's about to turn back on here in a minute. All right, Wendell's, Wendell's got them figured out, man. He's, he's almost sight casting them in the grass. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Wendell Show. You lost him? Man, he, he is on fire. He's a fly fisherman, so he's real in tune with the sight casting. And uh, he's just, Wendell is just hammering him. I bet it's another red, too. Dominating. Yeah. You might just be finessing them. I ain't gonna be able to fish for Wendell here, catching them all. Here, I got, I got the net over here, Wendell. That's another keeper, sir. <laughs> Dave, you need some help? <laughs> I'll play y'all's game. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Well, from Grenada. He ain't from Grenada, but he lives in Grenada. He's just dominating, man. He's got him figured out on that bank line. There you go. Good job. Man. Healthy fish, healthy fish, and he swallowed it. It's up or did he? Yeah, he tried to inhale it, didn't he? I guess after hitting it twice and not getting it, he decided, I'm going to take that damn thing. Yeah, he's legal. He's That's 20. 20 and a half. If it wasn't for the bait being in his throat so far, I'd say let's let him go. But really? I'm throwing within about three feet of the grass, and then I twitch it like one time at a, you know, and let it sit. Mm -hmm. Twitch it one more time and let it sit. There you go. They're coming out for that. Come guess. on. Yeah. It's working. We doing good. Yeah. Keep trying. Nice healthy fish. Yep. Beautiful day. Nothing like being in Texas. Put a window on the pink fish bite shrimp. Oh my God. 3.5 fighting those, shrimp. Those other guys are going to give me the rainbow colors. Oh, I know. <laughs> they ain't going to be able to tell you nothing all the fish you're catching. <laughs> Little rat rip. Little 15, 14. There you go. Man, you got a black drum? You sure yeah, do. Yeah, you is. sure do. I thought it was a red, but it's a I'll be darned. Let me take a pic before you throw them back. Okay. All right, we got a thunderstorm coming in. And they're kind of just working our way back to the launch in case this sucker hits. Man, I don't know. Well, the storm's hit now. I'm glad we started to come back. Just keeping a real close eye on it. You have to, man. I think we'll make it back before it hits, but only because we were watching it the whole time. 
You have to be real aware while you're out here. People talk safety. Safety's being aware and being conscious. I've been watching the rain in Aransas Pass with my eyes toward Lamar with my eyes and I'm double checking it on the radar to see if it's going the direction I want it to go. Another one popped up, started coming at us. I could see it, picked it on the radar, it was headed this way. So we started working our way back to the truck slowly. Common sense and being aware, being super present. You always want to be present when you're in the woods or water. Let's go. There's the rain. I can see the car is whited out. We get wet, folks. We get wet. I'm so glad I turned this around before it hit. I need to get out and help them. All right. Ah, uh, you should be on the concrete. Oh. Oh. What a mess. Yeah, it got us. What is that? And I'll tell internally. It came on pretty quick, didn't it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, it rained so much that I really didn't fall down in the water getting out of the boat. I didn't see nobody fall down. No, no, it wasn't me. That was that other guy. Yeah. Well, that didn't take long. There's a bunch more behind it, though. Mm -hmm. I think we got some more time for the next squall. We tried again, guys, but we had another squall coming in. I ain't chancing. I just whistled at everybody. You come guy with me. If I whistle, it means let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> if I stand up and whistle, it means we gone. You can see why I was whistling. I think we're about to get crushed again. Yeah, not good. Special shout out to all the new patrons. And patrons, be sure to check your feed tomorrow morning for the after the episode. Bam! Oh, that's a big one. That's a freaking monster. Oh my gosh! Pump down Louisiana, baby. Oh yeah! The fall bite is on, boy! 25 inches. So, thanks to Ty and Teresa, you guys have taught me so much. I'm slaying it. I've caught more fish in this past year than I have in my whole life. Uh, all you Patreon, if you get a chance to fish with them, go fish with them because they will teach you so much. What? <laughs>